Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, my name is Muhammad Uski Pratama and I'm from 6i and my NPM is 19.11.0401 and 39. Uh, in this presentation, I will present my proposal. Uh, it is uh, a critical discourse analysis of the image of Arabs in the American press. Okay, the chapter one, introduction. Uh, this chapter provides an overview of the study. It, start, it starts with high new importance of critical discourse analysis or CDA as a linguistic research tool. Then the problem of research is illustrated followed by a description of the context in which this study has taken place and an explanation of why it is needed. This chapter also offers an account of question, the objective, and the method of analysis used as well as the limitation of the study. And, and then the critical discourse analysis is linguistic research tool. Uh, critical discourse analysis or CDA has become prominent and influential of recent years. It has appreciated the, the term critical as a definition of its distinctive character, referring how language uh, is used for the exercise of social political control. Uh, according to Blomer and Wolken, 2002, discourse with an uh, opaque power object in modern societies is made more visible and transparent by critical discourse analysis. As a result, CDA has become a very important research tool which moves beyond a surface level examination of discourse to show how discourse can produce and hide deep structure relation of power and inequality. And the term and it's what I created here, defined by Van Dijk, 2001. Uh, discourse analysis, or CDA, is a type of discourse analytical research that primarily studies the way social power, abuse, dominance, and inequality are admitted, reproduced, and resisted by text and talk in the social and political context. With such dependent research, critical discourse analysis takes explicit position and thus want to understand, expose, and unlimited, unlimitedly research social and quality. You know, uh, the problem of research. Arab were portrayed in negative light in the media long before the attack of September 11, 2001, on the World Trade Center which gave this organization a giant story to come. An overwhelming majority of the American public turned to their newspaper and magazines for information and explanation, relating to the attacks. Arabs who replaced other minorities and ethnic groups, at example, blacks and Jews, a subject of the discourse of the press before the events were considered the suspect thus of this event. The current study seeks to explore the effect of the September 11, 2001 effect on the portrait image of Arabs by the critical analysis of the discourse of specific article published in this week in the Washington Post immediately after the event to see if the image has changed or remained as it was. And next is the need for the study. Uh, this study is the study bears a different dimension as it analyzes the discourse of two different prestigious press mediums uh, like a newspaper and a magazine. Magazine stresses a different period for analysis and use a different uh, linguistic models in the analysis of the specific articles. 
uh, the question of the study. The main question of research is what is the image portrait of Arabs in the American press after the event of September 11, 2001? In order to answer the question, the, foil, the following uh, sub question should be addressed as well. Uh, the first question is what is the image of Arab resulting work from analysis of the content of 14 specific articles of this week and the website post? And the second question is what is portrayed image of Arab result? from the critical analysis of this course of the article so resulting from the impressionistic reading of a group of data and the objective of the study uh, this study aims to achieve the following the first is language technology to find out the language features used in the portrayal of Arabs and their effect on this image like the textual structure of news content the choice and combination of words, the cinematic structure and rhetorical feature used to identify Latin ideology and relationship of power. And second is socially to unveil some of misconception of the image of Arab and suggest some modification if needed in the discourse used to portray them. And now the chapter two. Chapter two. Creator of journalistic writing. Uh, what is news? And also, how do journalistic choose the event to cover? These are all important questions that Merrill answer the element of news are endless conflict, consequence, human interest, faculty, prominence, proximity, speed, accuracy, objectivity, fairness, and finally, five competence. Importantly, still, uh, but still, objectivity means uh, like doctor and lawyers who sometimes must deal with the patient and client they dislike. And as well, and also journalists have to cover individuals for whom they have little sympathy and or empathy. That's acceptable. What is not acceptable is when the subject of the story or the reader of the story can detect the reporter's attitude. This definition of validity as being fair and the test from the basis against which the journalists in this research are judged. Uh, another, another important function of media is propaganda. Uh, journalistic writers are propagandists in the sense that, that they propagate or spread their own business and opinions to affect the autodis and action of their audience. A large number of journalistic included the so-called uh, strike news. Uh, reporters included in the program if they intend to lead, influence or sway their audience in certain certain terminals. And also following propaganda techniques are used by journalists, journalistic to achieve the above result. Uh, the first is creation of stereotypes. The second is presentation of op opinion as a fact. The third is speaking through source. The fourth, PS contribution. The fifth, information selection. And the fifth, news management. The sixth, use of labels. And the seventh, page authority 16. And the eighth, selective pensionary. And the last is one process across. Uh, the both ideas are significant in formulating our perception of the importance of media and role that it plays in forming stereotypes. In addition, they form the basis against which objectively or subjectively of the journalistic of the analyze article are measures based on moral description of the journalistic duties and Bell's ideas as regard to the use of quoting technique. And now let's uh, move to the next is the image of Arabs in the American media. 
Arab are stereotyped in four primary types in American media as well. Uh, barbaric in our culture, sex maniac, rival in act of terrorism, uh, and also Gharib. 1983, the Arab image portrait is not real image. It is uh, distorts a picture of the people, culture, and politics of the Arab countries. He traced the Arab image by quoting Alfred Lilienthal comment for good. The Arab would crop of in the terms of pyramids, camels, dancing girls, like dancing girls and perhaps and oil. Harit assured that most American picture Arab as a backward, scamming, fanatic terrorist who is who are dirty, is harness for sex and corrupt. Corrupt. Since 1967, another dimension was added to the Arab image. To Harib, bubbling courtly Arab, then this image was replaced by an Arab terrorist. And then after the Palestine movement, uh, so after 1973, war and the oil embargo, Arab were described as super rich, Arabs say controlling world oil and as greedy, grasping crooked Arab intent on undermining the American economy. Radicals and oil rich have supplanted the camels and also the palm trees and haram of the past. Okay, now uh, the chapter three or the last chapter is about Christian mythology. Uh, The method was to achieve the objective of the risk of this research and the rationale of for their operationalization. It includes the following section, uh, the source used in the 65 links analysis, the article selected, criteria for the selection, procedures of stage of the analysis, and finally the model of Randolph. Use in the analysis in order to answer the questions of research and finally reach a conclusion regarding the image of Arab. Thank you. That's uh, my proposal. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.